that's what camp is for, for competition and, and to uh, see who can make plays, who can improve. And, uh, that's what we're about right now is competing. And that slot spot, too. I mean, you got Cavante, you got Don. There's, I mean, there's, four there's no one set spot on the field right now that uh, you could say is locked off because you never know what can happen. You never know who can all of a sudden start emerging. And uh, with that being said, every day you got to keep improving. Number 11 making a lot of plays every time we come around. Oh, yeah, he's, uh, he's definitely a, he's a playmaker. And we hope we can, he can make a lot for us this year. And he's, uh, he's coming along. Marvin, you're coming into your last year. How do you assess the offense? You've been through this a lot of times going into the, the fall. Where is the offense at right now? Maybe as compared to years past. It's about the same as every year. You you come in and you notice that you have a lot of things you need to work on. Um, you know, sometimes it could be di at different spots, but you know, there's always stuff you can work on in each position, and, and there's always stuff you can improve. You know, uh, a lot of kids out here today probably looking for your autograph a little bit. I heard them yelling your name as you were running at the end. What's this like, you know, for them to, to you know, really it's, get uh, this day? It's, it's a dream. And, uh, you know, as a kid, it's really special to them. And you, you know, you don't want to take this for granted because, you know, you remember the days when you were a kid. You will see one of your favorite athletes and you'll want to autograph. So, you know, you take this and you, you humble. It's humbling. It's humbling. What does the team do the next three weeks? Hard and compete and improve every day. Um, you got to come out every day with the uh, mindset to get better. And that's what they call it. A little bit of a chip on your shoulder sometimes? You wouldn't call it a chip, but you know, you know you're the most experienced receiver we have. Yeah. So you know you definitely have to, uh, you, know, you can't make first year mistakes as a senior. The running back situation. Uh, obviously, Marcus Coker's kind of hands off, don't touch him right now, but then he, he a little battle for number two with Jason White. Uh, McCall and maybe DeAndre Johnson. What have you seen out of those three guys, the, the number two running back? Well, yeah, definitely. They all have uh, something else they bring to the table. And even with Marcus, you know, uh, it's, like I said, it's not a set spot. And, you know, there's always going to be guys that, you know, you never know what can happen in the season. So you, you always got to work for it. But those guys are good, you know, working their tails off in practice, trying to improve. And I've definitely, you know, been happy to see what I've seen out of all three of them.